Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we passed this bill out of the House earlier in the uh, session, but the Senate beat us, and so the version that's going to proceed is Senate Bill 1411. You may recall this is the recommendation of the um, Sexual Assault Evidence Tracking Commission, and what is important about this bill is that it mandates that everyone who touches the kit reports its progress through the system uh, with a mandatory reporting, and this is the um, Illinois State Police evidence tracking system that we're talking about, and it also provides a FOIA exemption for this information, which of course we would very much like to do. And once again, I ask for your I vote on this bill. Representative Carroll. Thank you, Madam Chair. Will the sponsor yield? She indicates she will. Please proceed. Representative, how long have you been working on this bill? Three years. Great. And, 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 and what, what's happened in the past with it? What have been some of the holdups? Um, well, the commission, first we had to um, commission the commission, then the commission did its work, and then they made a report about a year ago. And so uh, getting the report, the recommendations of the report into bill form and getting the bill through, you know, it takes a little while to uh, do this work. Great, thank you. To the bill, I want to commend my colleague on her hard work on this bill, the effort she put into it, and I think this bill strongly deserves an I vote. Thank you. Representative Parkhurst. Thank you. Representative McDermott, I just wanted to thank you for all your hard work on this bill. It really fills a need that was missing, uh, especially for survivors, uh, and uh, I would urge an I vote. Thank you. Thank you.